I got in trouble for saying the word chink on a, on a um, talk show, a network talk show, and um, it was in the context of a joke, you know, obviously. That would be weird. That would be like a really bad career choice if it wasn't. Um, but nevertheless, the president of an Asian American watchdog group out here in Los Angeles, his name is Guy Aoki, and he was up in arms about it, and he put my name in all the papers calling me a racist, and it hurt. You know, I mean, as, as a Jew, you know, as a member of the Jewish community, you know, I was really concerned, you know, that we were losing control of the media. And, <laughs> right? I mean, like, what kind of world do we live in where a totally cute uh, white girl can't say chink on network television? <laughs> it's like the 50s. It's scary. There are only two Asian people that I know that I have any problem with at all. Um, one is uh, Guy Aoki. <laughs> and the other is my friend Steve, who actually went pee pee in my Coke. And uh, <laughs> he's all, me Chinese, me play joke. You know, like, uh, if you have to explain it, Steve, it's not funny. And you have to break it down. Yeah. You have to be able to laugh at yourself. So that's what I tell Asian people all the time. And like, they don't listen. Yeah. Midgets. You know the politically correct. The politically correct word for midget is little person, which just tickles me because you know it's like. The only politically correct word that's actually more insulting than the original <laughs> one. <laughs> Midgets don't like being called little people. <laughs> you know, they much prefer, yes, you are. I'm ba 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 ba. I'm a boo boo boo. <laughs> Thank you for laughing at that. I appreciate it. I appreciate the laugh. I always feel crappy when I do that joke, but. Get such a good laugh. <laughs> I just feel like, what did midgets ever do, you know, as a people to deserve to be mocked? You know, they're human beings born extra crazy small. And, you know, <laughs> I don't think, I don't think like anybody here thinks we should make fun of midgets, you know, but, and, but we do anyway. <laughs> you know, I think it's because, I think it's because, you know, I'll tell you why we make fun of midgets. We're not afraid of them. That's what it always boils down to, across the board, you know? I mean, I had a joke with the word nigger in it that I thought was so edgy, you know, and so hip. And I was doing it all over, all over town, you know, at comedy clubs, and I was at this one club doing my show. And I look in the front row, and the whole front table is black people, and or um, or Af African American people, and um, you know what? It was half and half. I'm pretty sure. And um, <laughs> but the point is, I I I didn't do the joke, you know. And then you got to ask yourself: Is that a an edgy joke or is that a racist joke? You know, and I, I didn't do it because I was afraid of them, you know? <laughs> I didn't. And I ended up changing that joke to chinks. <laughs> so you live and you learn and you, you hopefully you grow, you know? I, um, I was going on, I was about to go on a talk show and, uh, and talk about that whole kind of idea, how we make fun of people that we're not afraid of, you know, but we, we refrain from making fun of people we, that scare us, you know, and uh, I was about to go on and the segment producer came over to me and he said, you know, um, instead of nigger, say the N-word. And I said, um, great, you know, what do you want me to say for chink? And he said, say chink. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I'd like to sing a song for you now. And, uh,
interested.